People define supermoons in different ways. One definition of a supermoon is a new moon or a full moon within 90% of its closest point to Earth for the month. We can't see a new moon. It happens when the moon passes between the sun and Earth and travels across the sky all day with the sun. The first supermoon of 2024 is the new moon on January 11th. According to the definition we just gave of newer full moons within 90% of their closest points, the new supermoons for 2024 are January 11th, February 9th, March 10th, April 8th, and May 8th. And check this out. The closest new supermoon of 2024 will fall on April 8th. It'll block the light of the sun, resulting in a total solar eclipse that'll sweep across North America. So you can't see new supermoons, but they help create super high tides as the gravity of a moon close to Earth pulls on Earth's oceans. These spring tides, king tides, or supermoon tides, also depend on the shapes of local coastlines and on local weather. Now about the full supermoons of 2024. A full moon is opposite Earth from the sun. The full supermoons of 2024 are August 19th, September 18th, October 17th, and November 15th. The full supermoon on September 18th is a super harvest moon. And the full super hunter's moon on October 17th will be the closest full supermoon for 2024 at 222,055 miles away. A full supermoon probably won't look bigger to your eye, but photographs do detect a difference. And anyone can see that supermoons look brighter. They're some 15% brighter than ordinary full moons, and they're about 30% brighter than a micromoon, the smallest and most distant moon of the year. So whether you live along a coast and enjoy seeing a high tide, or just a moon watcher, enjoy the supermoons of 2024. Wishing you clear skies, I'm Marcy Curran for Earth Sky. Deborah Bird and I produce this video. If you like our videos, please subscribe, like, and share. Thank you for watching.